Hey everybody, this is Travis from Crux Chiropractic, another really great pattern for you. Uh, this is uh, going to be called our low oblique variation. Uh, this is a progression of the low uh, oblique sit basic. So if you run through that one, give that one a try. Otherwise, what we're going to do is I'm going to have you set up almost exactly like your low oblique sit. This front leg uh, is going to be at a 90-90 position, almost in line with the belt line. This back leg, uh, I have been cueing everybody to continue to move this leg back until you feel just a slight uh, amount of stretch on the front of that thigh. Elbow goes underneath uh, your shoulder. From here, what I want you to do is I want you to start by driving this knee into the ground hard, and then I'm going to lift the bottom hip and top leg up off the ground from here. I'm going to drive forward with my hips, lean back, and then I'm going to sit slowly. I'm going to just kiss the ground and come right back up. Hips come forward. I lean back. I drive back. I really sit. I touch lightly. Come right back up. Drive the hips forward and have a seat. Let me show you from a different angle. So again, I drive forward, lean back, drive the hips forward, sit, just like the kiss, up, hips come forward, lean back, try to get that straight line, and sit, okay? Uh, the low oblique sit variation is a great way to train the outside of the hips, uh, great for runners, uh, great for uh, if you're in hiking uh, or if we're improving your walking gait. This is Travis from Crux Chiropractic. Thank you very much.